Hi everyone, I'm the Senior Tech and welcome to my YouTube channel. Experiencing a lack of power and poor turbocharger performance. In this video, I'll take you through the full diagnostics and replacement process on a 1.6 TDCI Ford Fiesta. The first test is to check whether the turbocharger actuator rod returns to its rest position after switching the engine off. As you can see, the rod moves up as the vacuum is released from the boost control solenoid. Next, let's remove the intake pipe to check for excessive play in the turbo shaft. I can confirm there is some movement, although I've seen worse cases. Now, I'll take the car for a road test to capture some dynamic logs. The results show that the engine produces almost no boost up to 2,000 RPM then just about 0.2 bar at 3,000 RPM, and around 0.9 bar above 4,000 RPM. That is definitely not the ideal boost curve for a diesel engine. Here's a quick look at the graph. With the accelerator pedal pressed to the floor, the boost is completely flat at low RPMs and only wakes up at the top end. It's clear this turbocharger needs to be replaced, so let's get on with the swap.
And now, the road test with the new turbo fitted. Looking at the new data, the difference is obvious. When the accelerator pedal is pressed, boost pressure rises much faster and holds consistently across the RPM range. Compared to the old turbo, which lagged badly at low RPMs, the new one spools rapidly and delivers strong power where it's needed most. This repair completely transformed the way the car drives, restoring proper boost response and performance. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe for more repair guides and diagnostics. See you in the next one.